welcome back to another Chris the Fish 03. I'm back for a quick one. Alright, so I just thought I'd let you all know for those that are still staying tuned and watching, thank you very much. But we've had a few changes in the fish room, one of which was a bit of a hiccup yet a blessing in disguise. So I'm going to turn it around now and show you what's going on. Right, so to start with, you might notice something different under here. So I've got my toolbox there instead of the two foot tank, that's gone. I've moved over my beta tank and my big planted tank has gone today. Now while that was going, we was also looking at all the tanks. Everybody knows my tanks, you'll notice in here for example, I've put a couple of the Texas in here. Uh, I've put a few of the Texas in here, if we can see any of them, they are. there's one at the back one there there's about six or seven in here and a couple in there and then in this tank I decided oh crap I've now got to take everything out because you won't see it too well on the camera there is still a load of babies in that rock the jags have actually bred so I'm like oh pants so this is what I've done I took everything out took a good few scoops as you can see there's still well you can't really see uh, let's see if I can zoom just about make it out there's still plenty in there for the parents to look after but what I've done is I've took a load of the fry out that was just three scoops there is absolutely thousands in there now I don't know how many is going to survive, if any, but I thought I'd have a better chance of having a few survivors by taking them out and putting them into their own little tank than I would by leaving them in with all the other fish to eat them. Also in this tank, that's on its side at the moment, but two goldfish, three tetras and the axolotl have gone out of here. And I'm going to explain quickly why. Right, so a quick explanation of what's going on in my head anyway. Because of what's going on with costs and job and kids and everything else, I've decided I'm going to cut down on the fish room. The YouTube videos are going to be every now and again, purely because I can't be bothered with chasing subscribers and views anymore. If you watch it, you watch it. Fantastic. If not, don't worry about it. But... I'm going to be getting into the Lego now instead with my son and daughter if she's interested. She seems to be so far. But basically, the three four foots I'm going to be keeping. The little beta tank I'm going to be keeping. Well, now I've got to keep the other little tank as well with the Jag Fry. But this tank and all its contents are going. As well as this tank and all its contents. So, yeah. The five foot's going, the six foot's going, all the fish that's in them are going, everything else is staying. So the three, four foots will stay up here. I'm going to look at having a big table here to build like a Lego city on. My beta tank will be incorporated into that, so it will probably be at the back and then build the Lego around it and stuff just so it still incorporates. And plus, I could never get rid of Dumbo. Look how stunning he is and I love how amazing this tank is. You'll notice there's a lot more greenery in there now because I took a load of the plants out of the planted tank and I put them into his instead. Plus I've also got a load of organizer trays. So that is obviously what all the Lego is going to go in. I'm going to have a unit across here with all the Lego in. Table across here with obviously all the Lego on. And then fish tanks on the other side. So I might be posting still on here with the Lego as well if that's something you're interested in let me know down below but in the meantime this is what's going on so as I say keeping them getting rid of the others I could have sold this six, uh, six foot tank about ten times over by now but because I can't sell the fish that's in it and it's a lot harder to sell the fish now obviously I can't sell the tank until they're gone. So it's going to take its time. The goldfish might be having a new home in about a week or so. But hey, we'll see how we get on. So 
so if you're still interested in watching what's going to happen as I say the odd couple of videos here and there make sure you like subscribe hit the bell and I'll catch you in the next video bye bye